Hi, my name is Eliazar Marquez. I'm currently a lecturer in mechanical engineering. How I got interested in mechanical engineering was in seventh grade. So I was invited uh, from the school to join text prep, which is a program here, uh, or the old UTPA. And initially I didn't want to attend, right? Because I didn't want to do anything over the summer. But my dad and my mom, they found out that I was invited to this program and they asked me, are you going, are you going to attend? And I said, no, right? I want to be with my friends. And they made me come to text prep and I liked it, right? And that's the reason that I decided in seventh grade to pursue mechanical engineering. I was born in Houston, Texas, but I did not live there. I was actually raised in Mercedes, Texas, right? Which is about 40 minutes from here, from Edinburgh. And I also grew up in Rio Bravo during the weekends because my father is a minister uh, there. Before joining UTRGV, I was a faculty member at Rice University. That's where I also pursued my PhD after I graduated from UTPA with my master's degree in 2010. So I decided to come back to UTRGV to give back to my community. Uh, since I graduated from here, I always believe that the students are talented, right? The faculty from here are very talented. So that's the reason that I decided to come back because I believe that our students can go and experience success just as I did. I currently teach dynamics and the analysis one lecture together with the labs, right? And one of the things that really excites me is to see the development of our students, right? Get involved in research, get involved in the clubs, get involved um, in internships, right? So they can succeed afterwards. So my current research involves modeling dynamic systems. So what I do is create mathematical models that predict dynamic behavior. In addition, I do also engineering education research where I develop uh, teaching strategies so I can incorporate in the classroom so the students can be better engaged, so they can learn, right? And they can retain the material a lot better. Since last semester was my first semester back at UTRGV, I was very excited and surprised to see the dedication of our students. Despite the COVID situation, I had students that were very dedicated uh, to going to the classroom, doing their homework, completing exams, right? And just for me to see them grow uh, professionally, academically, was something that I was very proud of. The message that I have to my current students and to my future students is to continue working on your academic success, on your academics, right? Continue studying. Believe it or not, the more time you invest in academics, the better prepared you're going to be. I always say that academics is like a professional athlete. So professional athletes become really good at what they do because they do it day, day in and day out, every day, right? That's what they practice and then they compete. And that's how they master their profession. Well, the same principle applies in academics. The more you invest, the more you study, the more you prepare yourself, the better you're going to, to become. So that's the message that I give to all the students. Continue studying, get involved. Believe it or not, that is how you are going to grow as a person and build your resume to get a job, to go to graduate school, to be competitive in the market. My current hobbies include going out for a walk every day just to de-stress from my day job and also watching movies, watching sports with uh, my family, with my brother. And thank you very much. Peace up.